Hello and welcome to another course brought to you by your friends here at Tuts Plus. If you'd like to learn more about this course, or any other course for that matter, head over to tutsplus.com. Now my name is Derek Jensen, and over the duration of this course, I'm going to take you through a number of the advanced topics within the C-sharp language. Now please don't feel intimidated by the word advanced, as I'm here to show you that you don't have to be a seasoned veteran of 20 to 30 years to understand these topics. You could have picked up the C-sharp language yesterday, or even just a week ago, and I'm going to show you that you will fully be able to understand these topics and put them to use. Now I will make the assumption that you've at least worked with the language a little bit, but if you haven't, that's quite all right. You can head over to msdn.microsoft.com. This is an absolute wealth of information where you can get a lot of information about the APIs and the topics that we're going to discuss, as well as a lot of sample code and downloadable projects that you can play around with and alter at your leisure. Now, this is definitely a very good way to learn new technologies and aspects of any language because you get to see what happens when you make changes to existing code. Code. So I definitely urge you to download some of the samples here and play around with them. I also urge you to head over to channel9.msdn.com as this is another great resource with a lot of articles and videos, oftentimes by people within Microsoft who are instrumental in the creation and the design of these topics that I'm going to be taking you through over this course. Now, I hope you're excited to take your development in C-Sharp to the next level. I'm definitely excited to guide you along on your path. So please stick with me over the duration of this course, and I'm going to show you that you can take any of these topics and put them to use in your day-to-day -day activities tomorrow. I'll see you in the first lesson.